Hey, I'm Matt with Pioneer DJ, and I'm here at NAMM 2020 at the Pioneer DJ booth showing the XDJ XZ. We launched this towards the end of 2019, and this is our first time showing it here at a show. Uh, what's great about this unit is it gives users the Nexus 2 experience, which is industry standard in clubs and festivals around the world, at a fraction of the price. So club DJs that play on this system uh, all the time in clubs, but want a system for home and for their mobile gigs that's going to give them the same experience, uh, the same muscle memory with their practicing that will translate to the pro DJ booths, this is the answer for them. Uh, so essentially what you have is uh, built in two CDJ 2000 Nexus 2s and a DJM 900 Nexus 2. Uh, you've got the same color effects on each channel um, where I can uh, change between six different color effects, I can adjust a parameter, and then I can send those effects to either one of those channels. You've got the same X pad on the beat effects. Uh, you've got all the effects of the 900 Nexus 2 and you've also got the ability to choose which frequencies you're applying those effects to. Um, and if you just set your level here, you can engage the effect by turning it on or off, or you can just start working the X pad and that's gonna be engaging it and changing the timing of the effect at the same time. You've got the same browsing experience that you would find on a CDJ 2000 Nexus 2. You can access record box laptop connected, you can access two different USBs, and you can access linked players with the built-in hub that's built in on the back of the unit. So on this unit we currently have our DJS 1000 connected and uh, coming in on channel one and then we also have an XDJ 1000 MK2 connected coming in on channel four and then I've got a flash drive here on channel one uh, playing uh, on, on decks one and two here. So on the two flash drive inputs, uh, on the second flash drive input, you can play music from it and also record your mix simultaneously. On the uh, master section here, you can adjust your master level and you have a three band EQ to shape your final mix that's going out to the house and you've got your booth levels here. Over here on the left side, we've got for the first time on a hardware product, we've got a feedback reducer. So you've got two microphone inputs with two microphone level and you've got a three band EQ on each mic and then you can engage the feedback reducer and set a, le a light or heavy uh, reduction and this is great if you need to hand your uh, microphone off to a guest speaker at an event and you're nervous about them stepping in front of a speaker or something and creating feedback this will help reduce uh, things like that from happening. So. This, with the same browsing experience, you would get the track filter where I can dive in and filter my tracks by BPM, color coding, you know, harmonic keys. In Rekordbox, we've got a metadata tagging system where you can go in and set metadata tags in your collection, filter your collection down. I can easily access a QWERTY keyboard for searching uh, through my music. And uh, this also features a uh, input on the back for the DJS 1000 that allows me to sample any of my channels to the DJS 1000. So the uh, XDJ XZ is now shipping and uh, it's available now. So thanks a lot. Thanks for watching. To be notified of more videos from our trip to NAM this year, subscribe to our channel and click the bell icon. Leave a comment or question below and check out our video playlist of all the latest and greatest products at NAMM.